The power of a magical boy and the parents who love him. He has the medical condition that ages him at accelerated speed. But his parents have made a breakthrough discovery while he changes the way other children think. ABC's David Muir and the teenager who is America strong. That sleepy walk down the hallway first thing in the morning, Sam Burns getting ready for school. Mom, can you hold my book while I brush my teeth? But for Sam, there is more, the medicine trying to slow down the aging. Sam has progeria, the disease that ages children far faster than the rest of us. So rare, fewer than 250 children in the world with it. A math final next Wednesday. A hug at the school bus. Love you, Mama. About to start her day, too. A doctor who now spends her every waking moment searching for a cure. And you say about your mom, she doesn't have a normal job. Yeah, I kind of just want my mom to be done with progeria for her sake, because uh, my mom will keep working forever until progeria is cured. At school, he's just Sam. No one looks at his hands, his legs anymore. They look to Sam for help. I got it. I'm just really confused. This is my, uh, tell me your equation. You're in math class. <laughs> yeah. And I love it, how you had to turn around and help the guy behind you. So just keep um, subtracting three just to make it easier on yourself. I'm sure there, were some, there was some simple math going on there, but uh, you know, I, I just think I was trying to help out. Through the years, as Sam has engineered his own inventions, his mother engineering something else, putting together a group of scientists, researchers, and they've made a bold discovery. Your team discovered the gene? Yeah. Just another day at work for mom. <laughs> <laughs> it was great. And along with that gene, an abnormal protein in children like Sam. We all have that protein. We do. We all have that protein, but they're teeming with it, and it accelerates everything. Hoping to slow it down, her team developing the first drug, the first trials with children as far away as India, and the results showing promise, slowing the progression. Doctors once told them children like Sam live to about 13. He turns 17 this week. You believe so many of us take time for granted. Mm -hmm. Every time I see Sam, it's sort of a moment. He gets off the bus. It's a moment, and I treasure it. There's a lot going on around us that you can easily miss. I really think that, uh, you know, I lucked out on the parent lottery. We lucked out on the son lottery, too. Yeah. <laughs> And from David Muir, America Strong. And we want you to know the documentary, Life According to Sam, debuts tonight on HBO.